Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 51. This is the final match of the first round, and we've got the greatest team of all time, Gadenix, eight, eh, not eight, six guard Wood Elves with another one missed next, two edge five dancers, unbelievable team. He's got that much guard, he's had to bench one of his guard players. <laughs> Uh, and he's up against some glorious birds, coached by Taki on speed. Uh, not a terrible bird team, but obviously pills in insignificance compared to these uh, these elves. And in the booth with me is Fymir. Hello. Hello, everybody. Here is the game. The team we are all be waiting to see. Gedenik. And this one is for our viewers in Tuvalu. Ooh. In Oceania. Another island. Where are very island... Uh, and the national flower is the plumeria Ooh. and the national this is the palushami mm. and they speak tuvalian and english because they have the union jack in the flag which means they were forced <laughs> to learn english a few years ago you you, you mean we visited them once <laughs> there was a touristic uh, expansion there you know probably Probably the Tuvalians have another opinion of it, maybe. Especially mm. the ones back in the day. There's only 11,000 people living there anyway. Yeah. I mean, this is definitely one of the best teams ever. It's it's given away a lot of TV though, right? A wizard, a bribe, a babe, and griff. Uh, it's, it's not hyperbole. This is an incredible team. There's six guard. There's a seventh guard miss next game. He's got so many guard he can't field them all. And uh, he's got two two edge five dancers. I think my team was better, maybe, but it didn't qualify. <laughs> and exactly. Shawnee's so, yeah. team I... was really good, but uh, he went out in the first round of dwarves. And, uh, you know, funnily enough, like, L elves can lose to anybody at the end of the day, right? Like, they can beat anyone, they can lose to anybody. This is the kind of good earth team you expect to see in a local league, you know, <laughs> by a guy that only plays a few games per season because he's very busy now, so he can play bass. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if the uh, Spanish have ever visited. Yeah, they did once, didn't they? Famously, one country they famously visited. <laughs> well, continent more than country. Oh, yes, 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 we have our uh, own scenes, yes. <laughs> yes, yes, we did, we did. In <laughs> fact, we did uh, most of the time earlier than the British, you know, and uh, and we left people there. Hmm. Oh, dear. I mean, this is hard, isn't it? But, he's, you know, he's, he's got a strength up, he's got a mighty blow tackler, which is, you know, all you need to, to have a shot against elves. Is a mighty blow tackler, and he's got a dirty player and a bribe. He took a few, three dirty players, and a bribe. So you know, it's he's got he's got outs, but uh, they're it, they're not likely to work. <laughs> Let's be honest. If it was a boxing movie, Taki on Speed will be one of the fighters that you see, you know, in the build up to the final uh, fight. You know, the ones that he has a montage of guys getting knocked out. I, I think if this was a boxing movie, I think I think Gadenik would be Ivan Drago and Taki on Speed would be fucking killed by him in the opening minute. <laughs> yes, it would be the sparring, you know, the sparring that dies out of the movie, you know, the one that they only mentioned by passing. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Yeah, it's a, this is a monster, monster team. Of, of course, uh, you know, it's, the players aren't that good, right? He doesn't have a natty, and he doesn't have strength on the blitzers. Um, but, you know, in terms of the whole team, like, having so much guard is completely incredible. And, sorry, how many reserves does he have? He has four reserves. He's a yeah. 15 players team. And yeah. only because there is one mix in next game. It's a 16 Woody's team. Yeah. And it's like about 25 games old as well. Just like literally nobody died at all. <laughs> this is what happens if, if Wood Elves don't take any cards. <laughs> Unbelievable. I mean, the birds are definitely rocky, aren't they? The birds are definitely rocky and... And Gedenik is is even Drago. No, Rocky is gonna be whoever uh, faces uh, Gedenik in the final if everything goes as mm. we expect. Yeah, yeah, fair, fair enough, fair enough. This but, is the 
attack unit speed is one of these guys, you know, that only appear a few frames, you know, to show how powerful is the opponent, you know, it's Shiva Drago, <laughs> crushing guys, you only see, you know, a few frames of each one. Yeah, yeah, fair enough, fair enough. But, you know, like, if it was real, <laughs> yes, yes, <laughs> Rocky yes. would have been killed by Drago. <laughs> I mean, so. instantly. There is no <laughs> chance in a real uh, boxing match that Rocky would have managed to survive in seconds. Yeah. With a fucking stupid training that involves not boxing at all. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, smart play from Nick going for the, uh, well, not only the easiest person to blitz, but also a DP, isn't it? Really nice. Also, if it was real, uh, Rocky would have died in uh, Rocky Balboa, wouldn't he? As he was just fighting <laughs> Fighting a, somebody about 40 years younger than him. <laughs> I mean, the brain damage just after the first movie will be just enough to end his career. Mm. I'm going to break a lance here for Ivan Drago, you know, being the big billion and all that. All the end of the day, he was doing only what he was ordered to do. Mm. It's not like he had a, cho a choice or anything, you know. The mm -hmm. Soviet Union, we're talking here, where the KGB, the guy had a spies over his, his own spies. <laughs> you know, so it's not like, Ooh. oh, thing like that. It's like these 80s movies, you know, where the bad guy, now you look at it, it's like Karate Kid, you know. It's like, why, why the guy from uh, Cobra Kai is the bad guy? Yeah. I mean, this guy comes... He starts flirting with his girlfriend, thing like that, blah, blah, beats him illegally. <laughs> yeah. This is yeah. weird, isn't it? That I thought for sure he was going to blitz uh, the catcher with a mighty blow, but instead he just, like, half-caged it. Gets a Kaz, though. Miss next. That was really weird, wasn't it? That's really weird that this is, like... This cage is, like, open. That's very dangerous versus a team with six guard. <laughs> Just quietly, this is, I mean, who, who's to say if it was terrible or not, but I think it was terrible by Tachyon Speed. Yeah, there's, there's not a cage, it's, it's completely wide open, yeah. But it is only a 1D, because he is strength 4. That's the thing, like, Daedal had the strength 5, Edge 5 Dancer, didn't he, and uh, that's pretty good. I had my strength 5 high off, didn't I? Um, which is yep. pretty good. And not having the strength is pretty bad. And not having wrestle either. Was that the war theory rule? He was having a straight ball and uh, tackle? Uh, maybe not. It's too early. Too early. Yeah. You still have a lot of time. I think it was a two, you re-roll it, right? But there's too much danger, you just skull and then lose your dancer and you feel really fucking bad. <laughs> now, the cage definitely isn't basically open anyhow. He's got a strength four carrier, like, that was needless to give up a 1D. Gets a pal. The problem that he's got now is making two dice blocks against all of this card. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God. oh yeah, the strength one, he's got a strength one catcher. Blood oh, he, he was a really 3D. Found the dancer. Oh my God, tragedy. <laughs> oh man, that's brutal. That's absolutely brutal. And now, I want to go back to Ivan Drago, you know. Apollo Creed makes a lot of jokes about him. Makes a fucking show in his fucking face, laughing at him all the time, so he makes him very angry. So if I was Ivan Drago, I'd ask, oh, you know what? I'm gonna absolutely destroy you. <laughs> God. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Ivan Drago deserves his own movie, his redemption arc. <laughs> yeah. So now with those two guards in, it is two dice on the ball um, on a two plus. And he's got the other edge five to recover. Bit of an irrelevant 2D here, but, um, you know, makes it, why not? Oh, what? What? Why didn't he, uh... Why didn't he... Oh, okay, so... 
Well, we can pause it. I, wouldn't you have leapt in here and hit him from here? So the only way is here, and then you've got this one right there. Like, I know it doesn't really matter. Oh, I guess this one's got Mighty Blow, and str oh, this one's got Strip. Yeah, okay. Okay, this one's got Strip, and this one didn't. But I quite liked hitting from that direction, so the ball would be, you know, the, the ball scatter would be from here. But I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, higher odds are getting, them, getting the ball loose. Yeah, fair enough. I understood why I did it now, at least. One had strip, the other didn't. Ooh. Oh, so the, yes, I know he's in Creed too, but you know, he deserves a full, uh, full movie. Yeah. No, I just didn't realize that one had strip and the other didn't. Gosh, uh, pay attention to the game, uh, Jim, for God's sake. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> this is this. I mean, this is this is disgusting. This is absolutely disgusting to watch. It's like. <laughs> Oh god. I can I can see Gedeinik going like Well 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 nice scatter pal where did you get it? <laughs> oh man Oh dear Doesn't Thomas T sidestep chooses to go away from another hit <laughs> surprising oh, well. <laughs> Yes, this is basically seal clubbing. Yeah. Not that Taki on speed is a joke, but you know, his uh, you know his team is just you know, mixed team blows everything out the wall. Isn't I, it? I have seen difficult games for teams in Chalice. In all the games I've casted, you know, people getting uh, having to face very complicated, very strong teams, very difficult teams, and this one is up there at the top. <laughs> one is like. What, what, what's taking a speech supposed to do? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hello, Thomas T. <laughs> One hour seven. <laughs> <laughs> Another seven. <laughs> oh, dear. Glorious. So, more or less, taking a speed here is uh, hoping for a 1 in 56 at the beginning of getting oh. turn. Well, there's one. Into a removal. There we go. That changes everything. I actually could. But why is fireballing? <laughs> come on, come on, man. It made, it made the fireball make it worse. <laughs> Jesus. Wait, that wasn't terrible. a blitz, what? Oh, he's blitzing with wrestle, okay, yeah, yeah. I thought he was making it 3D for him, but he's making it 3D for the wrestler. Oh my god. Well, he's got 3D with wrestle and he's got Griff, you know, nearly free. Gets the power. Okay, there are no elves around to pick up the ball. Yep, oh, and it's come perfect. So now the question is, do you do it with your player? Yeah, you've got to, haven't you? As much as Griff's strength for. Because you, you've got a rear off the pickup. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. He's, he's got a chance. He has a chance, and now he can uh, do, yes, some kind of a screen with Griff and uh, the piece and the. Foul him! Kill him! <laughs> Yes! 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 <laughs> Smashed hand, Apple fails. Tall sniffers sent off, but that's a great trade. Oh my god, best trade I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So yeah, you can hit with this one. Oh my god. Yeah, so he has to do the 3-2 to get the assist. Now the dancer just leaps and dodges, doesn't he? Gets the pow. Goes to Griff. Oh! Yes. <laughs> Justice! Justice is being made in this game. <laughs> Why? Why is this? Why is this game? <laughs> oh my god, it's a rocky, it's a real rocky experience here. Oh I'm my so, god. 
Absolute magnet hands from both sides. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. He rolls a one. Oh my god! <laughs> Griff! <laughs> Glorious Griff! <laughs> Come on, Griff! You can make it, Griff! <laughs> Do you need a grief and a dream? <laughs> All this just to score on his own drive, to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> Flip me. Flip me. You can't hit the... Yeah, he's just got a blitz, the dancer. No! <laughs> he's got a reroll. He's got a reroll. Oh, he works. He works. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. What the hell? What the hell? <laughs> he scored on his own drive. Incredible. He scored in his own drive. <laughs> And uh, yeah, you know the two the two send offs are okay, right? He's still got he's still got a big bench. Uh, he has used his bribe and his wizard, um, but you know he's made two cas. And while of course uh, Nick has a huge bench, um, obviously that's big quality, right? Big a big quality player. Oh, that uh, dancer gone. I mean, uh, whoever is in the next round is a very happy man. Mm. Means, means he gets to means he gets to field his guard lineman instead. <laughs> Disgusting, you know. <laughs> wait, wait, now. Uh, yeah, three sides. Uh, Gedeinik has his uh, chance to try to one turn. Yep. Yeah, it's not no one turn. Um, whoever said that, I agree. There's still a chance of the one turn here. He's going to go for it with the catcher. Use the edge five to fill all the squares. He can he can blitz this guy, and then push back and then chain there. Yeah. You'll probably see it. So you, you blitz this guy. You fill in all the squares, like all these squares, and then you blitz him and then chain back. And look, this is the guy who should have been scoring. What? I don't. Wow. Wait. I've got to say, right, that is bad. That is bad from Kadenik. That is that is bad. I mean, that is bad. That is bad. It's it's possible to do the the one turn with had a step uh, filling yeah, all the squares. For Kadenik, that is bad. Yeah, that is bad. And for coming from Gedenik, having that much agility and much all, you know, dodge and all that, he could have tried it. I don't know what was the mind uh, process there. Mm. Or maybe he's broken. He's a broken man, you know, mm. that uh, uh, grief uh, times and broke Gedenik. Yeah, yeah, maybe tilt. Um... Yes. If you that, that that's the link to KFOG series if you want to see how to do it, which uh, I'm sure I'm sure it, like you're one of the ones will have how to do that. Yeah, he must know how to do it. Like surely he does. Like he kind of set up to do it right with this the, the side stepper there. He set up in the right place, then he just punched with him. That was really weird. Like he literally set up to do it. Really weird. And now attacking speed only has to stop the Woodies. Mm. His bench. He's taken two cars, but I mean he's still he's still got a guard guy on the bench. <laughs> Needs to put that guard on the field now. This is a big skill test for Gadenik. Can he can he remember his 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 fourteen millionth guard? Doesn't look like it so far. Can you see the guard, guys? Uh, 
Oh, he hasn't. Oh, no. Oh, my God. This is a broken man. Oh, he's a he has. Griff has broken him. <laughs> second, second rock for the if, if you if you saw this if you're watching this live this was the point where Gadenik said he is not a man he is a piece of iron <laughs> <laughs> oh man wow well Maybe it's not happening. That's. That, I mean, that is really bad, though, isn't it? Not fielding the guard. It's not like he's minus AV or anything. He's just. There is a random line over there, so yes, it uh, doesn't make any sense. Maybe he did not. Maybe he just thought like you know he doesn't want to. He doesn't want to expose him. He wants to keep him for a harder game, and just you know, use a use a rubbish line out to take the mighty blow hits. What are you talking about, Jimmy? He's getting another guard for the next game. Yeah, no, I, yeah, I mean, I think he sh he spent 30 TV on it. I think he should be fielding it. But maybe that's what he was thinking. Maybe he did realise and he just thought he couldn't protect him. But it seems fucking weird. I definitely want him on the field. <laughs> I have no idea, uh, how to about the other ads. I mean, a long-time subscriber, so I don't know what the ads are you talking about. I'll tell. I'll tell you when the ads are. <laughs> oh, did he just? Oh no, the the line has been there. You go, the mighty blow tag. See there, you go. So that was a skillless guy, right? And um, so, you know, there's there's something to be said for you can't protect them. Um, tw the twenty-one minutes. Every twenty-one minutes, there's three minutes of ads. There you go. That's what it is. Kangaroo day. Nick had only won two SFL championships. <laughs> That's true. Well, no, he did win three SFL championships, but he is only a two time winner. <laughs> yes, he is only a two time winner. He is not allowed to see a. Uh... <laughs> Oh, they were out. <laughs> he's won. Yeah, he has won it three times, but he's not a three time champion. That's true. <laughs> yes, he won three finals, but he's not a three time champion. <laughs> And he's only a two-time uh, CCL winner, isn't he? So Burt's have got nine Burt's. And... Oh, ten Burt's. So and if uh, Gedeinik wins his third CCL final, could be the first title for Escuro. Mmm. Yes. Only a two-time CCL player winner. Yeah, he got the final, didn't he? But didn't win. That's it. Escuro is the three-five-eight champion. Everybody knows that. Yep. So a pretty relevant Kaz there, but still a Kaz nonetheless. Hello, J. Leave. This is a bit of like a half dacker, isn't it? Here from Nick. Very strange. This is the strength one guy. Where's the strength I one? I thought... Oh, the strength one's gone. I thought the uh, Gedenik was going to aim for a quick score and then a uh, turnover to win in regular time. Mm. <laughs> but right now, seems he's taking his time. Yeah, I mean, you might as well stall it out, right? Although I guess the humans do have a, uh, a one-turn chance with grip. Not much, but hey. Am 
Mighty blow tackle there. Oh, armor break. <laughs> Screw off, holy shit. <laughs> Yeah, we're finally about. We've finally finished season nine. Flicky and Flicky and Chunter took about fifty days to play their game, but they've, they've played it. And now season nine is complete, and we're about to do the playoffs. Where well, I've been a little bit diced by uh, Tom Schniz beating J Five to the playoffs, so I have a hard, very hard game against Wood Elves instead of a very easy game against Chaos. But never mind. Not not complaining, obviously. <laughs> Just letting everyone know. <laughs> Just letting everyone know I've been totally diced. <laughs> diced in a game I wasn't in. <laughs> Standard. He gets the big power. Exactly, Necropolis. Three, six, nine. So now there's nine elves. Oh, a cheeky one. Was that worth it? And he could have one in 36 dodged away. I mean, probably is an armor seven guy, isn't he? It's pretty tempting to punch him. No, oh, 3D. Get the tables. I mean, he's done the right thing. He's done the right thing here, attacking speed, hasn't he? He's given himself a shot. You know, he's max, max three Ds. You know, max the mighty blow tackle blitzers. Uh, fouled when he could. Like, you know, got two guys sent off. He's really he has, he has done everything he could. But uh, it's unlikely to be enough. But you know, it's looking like overtime at least, isn't it? And then he's got a 50-50 chance of having a drive and if he's got a drive and he's got the ball and the strength or bludger he's got half a chance and here comes the foul like that's the thing is like that's the thing isn't it like the chaos teams have just got a better high roll than than like well not chaos like just the bash teams in general have got a high a high better high roll than elf teams because you know, if you've got no players left, you definitely lose. <laughs> Whereas, yes, the, the Elves have got loads of players that can do anything, but they've still got to roll dice to score, you know, pretty much guaranteed. Or roll dice to stop you, you know? Whereas the Chaos, you can just be left with no players at all, and then uh, that's it. Well, there you go. He's got the, got the dice and got the ball in his best player, which makes sense. Hatch 5 leap is basically impossible to stop. Especially if you have any rolls. Mm. Another 3D, mighty blow tackle, lovely. Oh, killed him! Oh. Good God Almighty! Good God yes. Almighty! Kill him! Kill him! <laughs> if he dies, he dies. <laughs> if he dies, he dies. That's a lot of TV uh, trim down from uh, Nick's team. Yeah. And now the DP foul. Ooh, this guy could have had it. guard, but it wouldn't have made much difference, to be fair. Oh, he's rolled the double oh. one! Oh no, is it just a one? It's just a one. Oh my god. Oh, that was super exciting. I thought he literally thought he just rolled a double one. Man. <laughs> but there you go. Now, he's at, he's at risking double ones now, isn't he? Every single thing now. Reroll's gone. He's got dodgers left, but flip me. Yeah, it was huge. He's got to cover the front side and just leave this on at the back. Yeah, yeah. He had to, he had to get that one first, right? And then I mean, say leave this on. But obviously, he's going to try it. But he had to prioritise the front just because this guy could have got all the way around. Flip me. Do you do the uh, do you do the five plus dodging for a one D here? Maybe. 
Might be the best idea, and honestly. I think that's the best uh, chance to win in regular time. Mm. I mean, it's, it's horrible, but... Uh, you can just three dice this guy. Like, three dicing this guy is fine. But I think probably five plus him is not doing either. Not doing either of those things. I think either you three dice this guy with Mighty Blow Tackle or you five plus in for a 1D. Or Griff four plus in for a 2D. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Gets the pal! Oh, oh my god! Wow. Uh, 1D with Tackle is better than 2D without you. Yeah. But then the 4 plus dodging is better, isn't it? So, And then it means you've got a tackle in front and tagging. And so, oh my god. He's picked up the ball! <laughs> Hero plays here. There we, there we go, guys. This is it. Flip it's me. happening. It's happening. <laughs> oh. Gets the ball. Ooh. And picks it up. Oh, well. <laughs> This is still. Yep, had to make that one, but that's that's safe now, isn't it? Whew. Yeah, yeah, the 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 Griff play is better overall, yeah, because especially if you're not going to commit a reroll to it, right? The Griff the Griff play had a lot of payoffs over the. Over the tackle. So really good play from Tacky on speed, I would say. Well, I don't like this one as much as blitzing this. I guess it means that you've got the sideline locked down and you can get more stuff in the center. But I mean, you you can't stop him anyway, right? He's arch five lead. I'm sixteen. Yeah, bizarrely, bizarrely, this has actually been a really good game, isn't it? You wouldn't have fucking bet on it. <laughs> yeah, 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 it's been a... Very intense. And now... Just make some dodges there. Oh, roll some disgusting, this disgusting hell of uh, images. <laughs> but the uh, breath. Get more shots at the LOS. Mm. Wow, loads of removals. KO stay out for Nick. Come back for Tacky on speed. So now the L's are down to 3, 6, 9. Loads of players out. But still have another DP. I guess they'll keep him in case they lose the toss to, so he can kick, or is that wrestle? Yeah, it's kick, yeah. So I guess they still won't foul with him, but they can just foul with the rookie now, right? Doesn't matter if he gets sent off. The second dancer is cast, yeah. Dancer yeah. cast, catcher the dead. Next game. Two bludgers cast. Well, a bludger and a dodger. Bludge step guard killed, rookie killed. Now he has to field his guard, Lino. Oh, force it. <laughs> he had no choice. Yeah. And how costly will, will Nyx want botched one turn be? Because if he loses the toss, Bert's have got a chance. Maxing 3Ds. Love to see it. Love to see it. I max 3D here. No, but... 
and here's the pointless foul. Well, not pointless, uh, skillless foul. But you know, pointless not to foul here because you know you've got three reserves. You have to foul. Gets a removal. All right, and doesn't get sent off. So let's see who wins the toss. Oh, cheeky SPP farm. All oh, stay out for Nick. Oh my god. I think the uh, uh, Woody's won, didn't they? Yeah, Woody's win the toss. Oh, with eight this players. Is gonna be very hard for the Brits. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, zero out of five, wasn't it? I don't know if they happened in the first half as well. Still has four guard. Still has a move nine edge five. That's terrible. It's eight plays is enough winning the toss, isn't it? Still has three re-rolls. Birds are still on eleven. Oh the guard catcher filled two kills in the first half as well. Surely there was only one in the first half. Right? No, it was his drive, yeah, it was his drive, yeah. Sorry. Wow, so he's failed, failed seven out of seven KO rolls. Unbelievable. The Nafel, you know, sometimes gives the other time the other team a chance. <laughs> Kick. Uh, doesn't really do anything. <laughs> This is interesting, isn't it, from me? Uh, what, what, what has happened there? I mean, he could I, have gone with a war dancer and, you know... Uh, he just wanted to get into range this turn, right? Just wants to make it as quick as possible. Ah, uh, okay, get it over okay. He's only got eight players. I'm just going to roll all the dice. Which is... Uh, it's interesting, though, isn't it? Because... This is a bit like PC against uh, Devo, right, in the final, where he wouldn't have played like that in a normal situation. Normally, he'd have just gone with a pick-up with a Wood Elf, wouldn't he, and then send some people down the field and then see what happens next turn. But uh, because he knows it's over if he rolls all the dice, he's just going to try and roll all the dice. Fair point. Okay. Is uh, Griff going to come from behind? No. Griff could have gone for another 4 plus 2, do you right? That's a, uh, yeah, but anyway, that's a... Uh... Horrible situation because at the end of the day, the... The Woodies are just a handful of 2 pluses. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's the thing. It's a few two pluses, but like, could he have waited for but, something better? Maybe. No, I, I, I don't think uh, Sakion has, you know, many options here. It's a, you know, AG5, uh, movement 9, leap uh, piece. Yeah. I mean, like, could could Nick have waited? Like, do you know what I mean? Like, it feels like he'd force himself into this. Uh, but but maybe if Nick waited, two, the tackle it? piece would have been in a better position. Maybe, yeah. Maybe. So now, you know, he has to use all the... Uh, Oh, he's reversing. He's reversing. Coming back to the middle here. Is he? No, he's gone for the skull. Oh! Oh my god! Ah, oh, tripwire! Oh. <laughs> the tripwire! Oh. oh, the tripwire works! There is just this! I can hear the blocks of butter falling to the ground in basements all over the world. <laughs> Unbelievable, Jeff. Wow. Flip me. Flip me. Wrestles him down. 
pick up the ball with the IG4, foul with the... Foul with the peasant, yeah, let's fucking yeah, go. Yeah, that's it, that's, let's fucking go. Pick up the ball. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, my GFI God. GFI foul. I guess do the mic yeah. roll hit first. Yep. Do you even re-roll this if it's a one? That's the question. I guess you do, right? Because that is the dancer. Another removal. Oh my god. Here we go. Oh, well. <laughs> well. It did enough, I guess. It could be enough. Mm. Wow, what a game. Now Gdenik needs to do some of his uh, magic to make this uh, work. Yeah. Not very many players to do it, but you know, he's got some guard and some edge. Oh man. Oh man. So, does he go Question back is, and foul again? <laughs> yeah, you, yeah, you do the. Do you try to hand off to Grief just because Grief is a strength 4? That's a good question. Or he's got, he's got, he's got his own player with strength 4, hasn't he? Oh, but he's up there. I guess he and can't take the risk. Three. Yeah, he can't, he can't take the risk. He's got to just keep it on this guy. Any ghouls allowed around? <laughs> What's that? Something, uh, some uh, Battle Brothers thing? No, 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 I, I had an undead team called Ghouls Allowed. <laughs> oh, of right. allowed. <laughs> oh, Christopher Bengtson. Bengtson. Wow. So, yep, no hit on the ball this turn. But he recovers the dancer. Oh! Another cast, another removal. Mm. Got playing Blood Bowl 7s here almost. Rooted Tree is pretty painful now, isn't it? Pretty easy well, to avoid what... him when there's so few L's left. That, like, that's, that's one of the things that I've thought about the tree, you know, like... The games you lose as elves. Or when you have, like, you know, get brutally banged out, right? And you've got, like, five L's left or whatever. Or three L's left. Or four L's. But, and and then the tree is, like, at its worst then, isn't it, you know? Like, when it's yeah. not an elf. So it's interesting. Like, it does do good things when the game is in the balance still. But, like, when it's absolute desperation, the tree is fucking terrible. <laughs> I like the guard in that corner. Oh, man. Wow, he's getting he's getting the scoring threats up here, isn't he? Again, this is maybe the turn for Nick to go in for the ball. It looks like he's content just to blitz Griff and stay in front. I think he maybe should have gone for the ball this turn because there is a lot, you know, these two guys out in front, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of potential for um, attacking on speed just to win the, yes. win the game this game. Yes, yes, uh, there think is a strength four there. There is a strength four there that if he gets the ball and runs away, it's very yeah. difficult to catch him for the elves. Yeah, I think Taki on speed did this against uh, somebody with Necro as well. Like, if he, if he hands off to this guy, he's gone, isn't he? Isn't he safe? I think he's safe if he hands off here. He also has another guy to uh, provide some protection. I just think he's I just think he's completely in the clear. 
Maybe he isn't. No, he's got plus move, hasn't he? It's pretty in the clear, though. It'd be uphill. Uphill, red dies. Uh... He's definitely going for it, look. Yes, there you go. This is the play. Oh, we should have passed it. He should have passed it instead of that GFI, shouldn't he? Yes. I'm pretty sure. Yep, sideline. And then he can be there or somewhere. Maybe he should have been like here, covering a diagonal. He can use that one oh. to cover the diagonal. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Takion Smith is in the chat. Takion Smith in the chat. Don't don't say anything. Don't spoil anything. Come on, Rocky. Dodge gone. Oh. Lib works, no! And he just stands in the way. What? Was that a misplay? This is the blitz. He did, so he, no, he didn't. He knew he wasn't blitzing, because there's the blitz. Uh, why did Nick think that was good enough? <laughs> I think you had to uphill him, Nick. Also, I guess he just didn't. He just didn't hit blitz, and that was the mistake. So he uh, thought he just didn't hit blitz before, I guess. Yeah, forgot to blitz, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, forgot to blitz. Oof. Yeah, it must be. Like, you can't think standing here is good enough. You just can't. Yeah, so he must have... Well, no, because he didn't select the blitz, so he must have just misclicked not blitz. Yeah, he must have just not blitz. What, what, a, mom, what a time to do a misclick. Wow. Yeah, because you can't think this is enough. Like, you just can't. So, yeah, he must have misclicked. Well, yeah. Oof, that's sad, isn't it? Because he, he did all the things to get the uphill. And obviously the uphill likely doesn't work. But that was a bit of a... <laughs> In the... Oh, <laughs> Adrian! Adrian! Oh my god! Oh my god! Attacking his speed becomes the hero yeah. of the Chalice. Yeah, unbelievable. Absolutely GG. Wow. What a game. What a game. And oh that probably god. explains why Gedeni hasn't been uh, cast the uh, streaming for the last few days. <laughs> no, no, they literally just played last night, but his, uh, his internet crapped out. Oh, okay, um, okay, 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 okay. And uh, attacking speed. Seeing as you're in chat, uh, what, was it you that did like some kind of crazy handoff play versus Necros one time? That, that rings a bell to me, but... Uh... Whatever it is, unbelievable, unbelievable result beating Nick's monster, monster Wood Elves. Uh, huge congrats to Taki on speed. Uh, unbelievable Burts, just unbelievable Burts beating. You know, to be fair, Burts are one of the teams that can that can win against Elves, Elves isn't it? They are fast, they, they do get tackled, they do get dirty players. Like, they do have the kind of things that you can use and obviously used it wonderfully well. Rolled, rolled well, and yeah, unbelievable! Congrat, massive congrats, attacking on speed. Commiserations to, to you know, to Nick who came in with one of the best elf teams we've ever seen. Unbelievable tragedy. Two of the best teams were, were actually of the three best Wood Elf overall teams I would say that I've seen. One didn't qualify for Chalice, and two went out in the first round. So maybe if you want to win, you shouldn't make such good Wood Elf teams. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, what a game! What a game we have uh, watched here. I'm pretty sure our viewers from Tuvalu must be really impressed. My God, yeah, my God! Once again, the favorite to win the challenge gets out, sent back in first round. Absolutely unbelievable! Oof. Yeah, yeah, unbelievable. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.